Hello YouTubers, Merry Christmas and welcome to day 3 of the 12 days of Christmas Cards Diecasts. And today we're going to take a look at Derek Williams, the RSN microphone reporter car from the first Cars film. This was suggested and voted by Good Guy Man. So I will leave in the description down below. Now before we get right into the review and unbox, review and the retrospective, let's take a look at his unbox his box packaging. Here we've got his artwork and the old cars logo and the red background and the the die cast on the inside and the his name Derek Williams and the the metal logo and the Mattel logo and on the back we've got the old cars logo we've got some of the cars on the back we've got damaged the king who I don't have Murray Clutchburn Dash Boardman Dexter Hoover with checker flag Chick Hicks Brad Windmiller who I don't have and spin out Lightning McQueen, who I also don't have. And on the back, we've got it says "Made in Thailand" and other foreign languages. The RSN logo saying "RSN Racing Sports Network." The Mattel logo saying "Empowering the Next Generation Through Play," and the Disney slash Pixar Plymouth Superbird Petty. So. Without any further ado, let's, let's, I'll be back with his retrospective once I've, after I've finished unboxing him. So, now that he has been opened, let's get right into the retrospective. So, <clears throat> Derek Williams is a generic two-door sports coupe car who happens to be a mic microphone reporter car of the Orison network. In 2005, during his appearance in the first Cars film, he w was one of the paparazzis led by Corey Turbowitz to swarm into Radiator Springs knowing about Lightning McQueen's current whereabouts. He was, he was also shown when Mac was pull pulled into Radiator Springs, relieving that Lightning is still alive. He, and when Lightning was being hauled out of Radiator Springs, he also, he was presume, I presume that he was one of the re pro reporters to follow Mac. And as it turns out, that Doc Hudson was the one that called Derek, Corey, and Corey, and the rest of the paparazzis. Although I still think it was very selfish of Doc to kick Lightning out of Radiator Springs when he was trying to help the whole townsfolk put radi bring Radiator Springs back on the map. But what do you guys think? Was it actually selfish of Doc to kick Lightning out of Radiator Springs? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And during his diecast releases, Derek Williams had been released as a single twice in 2021 and in 2022. So now without any further ado, let's let's dig right into the review. So here we've got his chrome silver gray paintwork and his happy expression with his the white shiny smile on his front bumper. And the the headlights and the gray gr his gray grill, no tampons on the hood or on the top, and on both sides we've got the chrome silver rims on these on his black wall tires and the black silver lining trim on his door 
and his his side view mirrors and the his microphone right there. And on the back, we got no license plate and just the red tail lights and the exhaust pipes. And under and on the back care back underneath the back undercarriage, we've got the Mattel logo, Disney slash Pixar made in Thailand. And that is it. Now let's pull up some of the other reporter cars. We've got Corey Turbowitz. Shuki, Bert, Dash Boardman, Cora Copper, Skip Richter, The two two reporter helicopters. I'm not sure what which one of them is Kathy Copter. Oh, and oh, on that wait, I do remember Ron Hover and Kathy Copter. Yeah, that's right. Their names are Ron Hover and Kathy Copter. And finally, Nelson Blindspot. And that is it. So, what do you guys think? Which RSN reporter car is your favorite? And which car for day four do you wish for me to review next for tomorrow? Let me know what you think as well as leaving suggestions and vote off which car for day four tomorrow should I review. So I'll leave a voting poll for day four in the community tab in the description. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for Day 4 tomorrow. So please stay tuned. And I will still leave a voting poll in the community tab in the description as you please. So, until then, see you guys tomorrow for Day 4. Merry Christmas. Goodbye now.